Okay. Uh, hi again. Hello. Hi. Greetings. I don't have an intro yet. Um. So, I recently shaved. Right. You can see here. Uh, I recently shaved uh, last night. I shaved. Um, and it made me realize that I actually look way better when I shave. You know? Because I notice I, you know, I look clean. I look distinguished. I look elegant. I look clean. I already said that, but whatever. You know, I look like a, a new man. I look like a fresh person. And I want to talk about that. Because, frankly, I think the thing of men shaving... The thing of men shaving and being clean on the face or even on their body, I think it's, it's, really, it's really looked down upon. I think men should give more attention to it, and women. Especially women. Like, people should just give more attention to it because... I mean, think about it. If a guy wants a clean-shaven woman, don't you think that she should want a clean-shaven man? You know? Just saying, think about it. If you want clean-shaven women, then they want clean-shaven men. And you're like, no, babe, I don't want to shave my beard. Or I don't want to shave my pubes. Or my legs, or my fingers, or my arms, or my chest. I don't want to, it makes me a man. But hey, I, you should do that, you should. You know, satisfy your woman. Please her, do what she says. If you want her happy, do what she says. Now, anyway, right? But I think shaving really is actually important. And I always... Like, I always hated my school for this. I always hated my high school for this. Because my beard grows uh, pretty quick. My beard grows really fast. And in school, they would always tell me after like... After like a, a, a week or two, they would tell me to like shave it. And back then, I always hated them for it. Like, I would get mad. I would get pissed and be like, Ugh, fuck those teachers. Fuck them. Fucking assholes. It's my beard. My rules. But, thinking back to it now, it's actually... I actually, I, I have a way different view on it now compared to back then. And I'm actually... I actually think it is important to shave and look clean because believe it or not to me in my opinion that is the way to go like men should look clean because ever since like evolution you know ever since like the the beginning of humanity men have always been this hairy creature men have always been so hairy but that would not be that that wasn't the reason for a female you know being attracted to them that wasn't the reason they don't give a fuck about them being hairy that wasn't that wasn't why they wanted to be with them it was either because they could you know provide for the family uh because they were big and strong uh because they could you know hunt or because they could cook, or maybe they were the, the tallest, or, you know, probably had the biggest penis, I don't know, right? That was why they were with those males. Or, and, no, and, and another reason, is because uh, the men would fight for them. The men would fight for them in combat. That's why the females were with them. Not because of their body hair. But yeah, that's a... That's a topic for another time. 
I want to get down to it. What we were talking about, which is shaving, which I think really is good, but guys, you don't have to shave everything. I'm not talking about everything. I'm talking about, you know, maybe the parts of your body that are covered in hair that you don't like, that you're uncomfortable with, that you have, you know, low self-esteem about. You know, the parts of the parts of your body that um you think look ugly or you think need to be shaven. I'm talking about those parts. You should shave them. So, first on the list, pubes. For fact, pubes. First on the list. Get that bush out of here. Trim that forest down. Cut down the forest. I'm telling you, girls really do not like that. I'm telling you, girls really do not like that. They don't like that forest. They don't want to see a whole forest down there. So just trim it down short. Especially if, let's say, if you have hair, if you have a uh, hair or pubes on your dick, then you should definitely be sure to shave that off because it's going to make it look more clean, pristine. It's going to make it look, it might even make it look bigger. It will, trust me. It will make it look bigger because then you'll be able to see those, you'll be able to see those other two, that other inch or those other two inches that were gone, that were hidden in the, the bush, in the pubes. You'll be able to see them. And it will just look better, you know. It will look more presentable, more attractive. And then another thing, uh, you know, beard, face. Uh, but that depends. It depends mostly on like how thick your beard is and how old you are. If you're like a younger person like me, then yeah, you should definitely be sure to shave more because you know, your body is still young, your body is still fresh, your body still looks good. You know, you still have good facial features. Your face is still looking good and slim. So you want to keep that so you can let people see, you know, like how slim you are, you know, mm, nice jawline, all that stuff, you know. But as you get older, you can keep some of the beard because, you know, you're going to get older. You're probably going to get fatter. You're going to probably gain more weight. Um, you're going to probably have like a, you know, double chin. So you want to keep the beard then. But... Throughout your young years of life, be clean, be shaven. Trust me, girls actually really do like that because they want to be able to, they want to be able to feel your face, you know? They want to feel your face. They want to feel your, your jaw. They want to be able to feel your, your, your cheeks and your lips, you know, and your neck. Especially if, you know, it starts to grow out again and it becomes all stubbly. <clears throat> if it, especially when it becomes all stubbly, like girls like that too. And if you are growing hair on your your hands, like especially here, and your fingers, like shave it. You don't want people to think you're like a caveman or something, or like a or like a monkey. So yeah, shave that clean. Uh, your feet, as well. If you get hair on your feet, shave the hair on your feet. Um, because let's be honest, no one likes hairy feet because uh, it's such a thing these days for people that have like a foot fetish or like a foot kink. That is so weird. That is so weird. Anyway, right? So be sure to shave your feet. Okay. Also, because if you're wearing socks and you have, and you have hairy feet, it's very uncomfortable. And it's very painful. It feels like you put like sticky tape onto your feet and you just, and it's like you're slowly peeling it off. That's how it feels if you have socks on and your feet are hairy. So yeah, 
shave your feet. You know, shave your feet, shave your hands, shave your pubes. Uh, shave your beard and your monobrow. You know, over here. If you have a monobrow, like, okay, well, no, don't shave it. You have to pluck it out. Because if you shave it, then it's gonna grow back. Because you didn't pluck out the whole, you know, hair follicle. You didn't shave the whole hair follicle, it's still there. So you need to pluck it out. Easy as that. And be sure to do it uh, properly. And uh, yeah, that's all I can say. What else? Like, it might not seem like it, guys, but girls really do like a guy that's clean. Because that's, a, that's what they want. They like a guy that's clean, you know? They want to be able to see him. They don't want to see the hair. Yeah, there are girls out there that like hair. But... At the end of the day, they, they end up hating it. Because it gets everywhere. Hair gets everywhere. So... Yeah. That's all I can say. Uh... Yeah, I'm done. That is the end of the video. If you liked it, hit the like button. Uh, subscribe. I really appreciate that. Turn on the, turn on the notification bell. Because I will post a lot more like this. More of this kind of stuff and a lot more. Just, you know, stay tuned. And uh, yeah.